for this week. The counties do have a challenge in terms of staff and helping, but they also have to be aware that somebody needed the assistance. We, we had, and then it got cut, and now it's back again, Minnesota Care Outreach. Um, and for people who could hook up, uh, if somebody is lower income and they're having some difficulties, or, or anybody over 55 and they're having difficulties with accessing health insurance at any level, what I try to do is get them in contact with the lake because they can help them with some of those things. So one of the things I always think you do as you were talking is that I used to help people with those forms is you really shouldn't need an attorney to be able to access health insurance. And that's, in a lot of cases, that's almost where we're at. We either need a family member who can spend half to full time to try to provide them ongoing documentation, or we need somebody else. And I think one of the things that when you were talking, uh, John, about the the system in growth that's part of it you know, on the paperwork on the provider side as well as on, on the consumer side is just really high and i know that we, we struggle to figure out how to deal with that um, so thank you for bringing that across particularly greater minnesota where we have some uh, access related issues in the twin cities and particularly with dennis and OBGYN, frankly there's not enough of them first of all so we could have regular insurance and not be able to find anybody as well there is a lot of the person in town that takes it, but frankly, in general, they're full. And so it's actually met John almost an hour and a half to two hour drive for many people that are just trying to access uh, dental coverage. So it's, it's a real challenge, and, and it's something we need to figure out. We've been playing out that I used to, at one point, I, I think somebody did our work for the Senior Law Project for a while, and we had um, a senior, somebody who was just over 55, who struck to for broken. And this is still an ongoing issue and you know, medical assistance, and what would be covered were temporary teeth. So plastic, temporary teeth. And what the dentist said is, this is bad dentist, so you could get new ones every six months. Now think about the cost of going to the dentist every six months. And think about what that, it's bad dentistry, and the cost is high. But to be able to get the kind of coverage that's going to be an ongoing challenge. I and mean, it's something we have to figure out how to be working together. But part of the problem, frankly, is we don't have dentists. 